What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to some UFC gameplay. Today, if you guys were paying attention at the end of yesterday's episode, you would have seen that we picked up a super fight against heavyweight champion Kane Velasquez. We're not fighting for a title, this is just a super fight. So uh, let's see what we're going to go and improve. We don't care about submission, I mean grounds, maybe takedowns, let's put that body health up to the max. Leg health movement. Shall we put leg health up or shall we do takedown? Let's put our takedown up. And let's put our ground passing up and just improve that ground game that little bit extra. There we go. And we've got 32 points. Let's do a joint submission. Not that we really do submission. But so there you go. We've got a 94 ground game and an 89 stand up game. Guys, let us go and get into this fight against Kane Velasquez and knock this heavyweight the fuck out. It's a heavyweight collision between El Diablo and heavyweight king, Cain Velasquez. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 17 wins, 6 losses. Standing six feet, one inch tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of San Jose, California, USA, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Kane Velasquez. Introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 27 wins, 2 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, El Diablo. And when the action begins, the referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. Mario! Right guys, here we go. We can't go really in all guns blazing against Cain Velasquez because he has got arms like you wouldn't believe. You know what I'm saying? Like he will just he will just end my days in no time. So we've got to uh we've got to be we've got to be clever with this. We've got to be I know this is still on easy, but we still gotta be clever, you know? Still gotta uh Superman punch bitch. Oh he's hitting my body hard. He is hitting my body hard. That takedown attempt was stuck. Head kick. Nicely done. Back and forth battle. Look at that, he's already cut me open actually. Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Come on. Come on. You need to get busy now. Oh damn. Oh damn. Kick. Oh damn. Superman punch, bitch. Good defense and a right hook counter. No, 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 no. He's put me onto the cage. There we go. Man, he's really doing okay, and let's try and take him down. See if we can take him down. No, come on, game. I'm doing the. Okay, don't worry about it, game. Let's not take him down. I didn't want to take him down anyway. Shoulder strikes really keep his opponent off guard. Keep him thinking. All right, here we go. Oh, oh, oh! We caught him with it. Oh, oh! We've done it. We just knocked out Velasquez. Get in. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. And as we can see here in the replay, it was the hook that ended this fight. Let's see it one more time. Look at the power in this hook as it lands for the knockout. And here it is again. Boom! And he's out. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 11 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, El Diablo! So guys, there you have it, a one by knockout. That first right hook, we came out of the clinch, hit him with that right hook, it absolutely rocked the fuck out of his socks. You know the rules, if we hit the fight in the first round, if we end the fight in the first round, we go into a second fight. 
And that's exactly what we're gonna go on and do right now, guys. Let's go. Hi, I'm Forrest Griffin, and that's an incredible winning streak. I've never done anything like that. You, therefore, are better than me. Congratulations. Right, the next fight we are offered, guys, let's have a look. Boom, we've been another fight against Alexander Gustafsson. He actually gave us a really decent fight last time. Uh, he almost knocked us out in the first round. We managed to get that KO in the second round. So let's go ahead and fight Gustafsson again. I'm going to go through training. I will see you guys at the fight. Let's go. Coming up next, it is our main event of the evening between El Diablo and the Swede, Alexander the Baller Gustafsson. Alexander Gustafsson working his way to the octagon with only one goal in mind. And that is to leave as the new UFC light heavyweight champion. Alexander Gustafsson is one of the tallest fighters in the UFC's light heavyweight division. And that length and reach poses real problems for his opponents. He also has outstanding footwork and accurate striking technique. Gustafsson enters the octagon, looking to become the new UFC champion. El Diablo looking very confident tonight. As he makes his way towards the octagon, he is fired up and ready to fight. This guy is taking shots to the jaw that would put many fighters unconscious and pressed forward as if nothing happened. His chin is legendary. El Diablo enters the octagon tonight, looking to defend his UFC. Light heavyweight belt. Our tail of the tape for this light heavyweight championship fight. Gustafson is 37. El Diablo is 39. Gustafson is six inches taller. He will have a seven inch reach advantage. And once again, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, Referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Light Heavyweight. Championship of the world. Introducing first, the challenger, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist for the professional record of 22 wins, 9 losses. Standing 6 feet 5 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Stockholm, Sweden, Alexander the Mora. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 28 wins, two losses. Standing 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing at 205 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, presenting the reigning, defending, Disputed UFC right heavyweight champion of the world, El Diablo. All right, this is for the championship bout. I want you guys to do a heavy fight. Follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Good luck tonight. Touch gloves. All right, guys, here we go. Fight two against Gustafsson, the rematch. Last time, he caused us some issues, you know? He caused us some big issues. 
Oh Jesus Christ, he's uh he's hitting me with these kicks quicker than I'm hitting him with these kicks. He blocks the point. These guys are going at it. Yeah, we're going at it. But I don't want to go at it. Because I can't defend myself when I go at it. Look at my head and body already. No, 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 no. Oh, God damn it. This is what happened last time, remember? Come on. There we go. Half guard. Come on. There we go. So let's turn him over. Just hit him with a few first. No, 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 no. Game. Come on. Let's get out. Let's hit him with a few. And then let's turn him. Boom. There we go. Now it's my turn. Come on, Gustafsson. Let's go back into... Uh... Oh, wow. We've actually just mounted him up again. Hit him with some left. Hit him with some hammer fists. Oh, there it is. Hammer fist, bitch. Hammer fist. Hammer fist, bitch. Oh, you want to stand up? You want to stand up? You know what's coming now. Superman punch. Oh, wow. You got lucky. Beautiful Superman punch. Oh wow, I did the cage thing. Oh, I did the cage thing. We got the cage. Somebody's gonna go down. No, Gustafsson, come on, bro. Really missed with that right hand. Oh, nice uppercut. Powerful right hand. Huge kick misses. Flying knee. Nice uppercut. Sorry guys, I'm concentrating right now. El Diablo with a solid front kick to the body. Trying to get a head kick in. Oh, jumping knee. Oh, oh. combination. Oh. oh damn, he rocked me. Oh damn. Whoa. Oh, I thought he knocked me out right there. When I was dazed and confused, I thought he knocked me out. This guy is too good. We need to fight a lot, a lot better. A lot better. No, 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 no. Oh, man. This is one of those fights. I know it is. Come on. Let's try and get him into... Nope. Okay. Let's just break. Oh man. The leg, completes the takedown. And be that was a tough round, guys. We lost that round, that's for sure. He hit us. Gustafsson is frustrating to play against. We gotta we gotta keep this up. We're just gonna run straight out. Superman punch, spinning wheel kick. That wasn't it. There we go. Oh wow. Well. Some body shots. Head kick. Superman punch. Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Oh, beautiful hook. Oh, he's getting some hip in that one. Oh, that's a big head kick again. Oh, and again, caught him straight. Oh, and three in a row. My body is fucked up right now. He did a great job blocking that big kick. Hit him with a jab. Gustafson gets nailed by that head. Oh. No, 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 get up. There we go. Nice block 
after the punch to the head. Outstanding combination. Swing and a miss. Again, guys, apologies. I know I'm uh, silent right now. This this fight is intense. Gustafson with the sidekick. Come on, we need to start getting some uh, getting some punches off now. Joe, that kick hurt. One minute left in the round. Look at him, he's backing off. Nice job with the roundhouse. Big connection. Oh, I've rocked him. Yes. No. Oh damn, I thought that was it. Come on, we've got 30 seconds. Let's try and pass his, uh, pass his guard. 20 seconds. Oh, he wants to stand up. You know what happens now? Uh. Oh, wow. That's it, he's out. Yes, that was again the tough fight. Two fights in a row against Gustafsson. So tough. El Diablo wins by knockout. Beautiful KO just as the round was ending. Once again, here's our fight replay. And as we can see here in the replay, it was the hook that ended this fight. Great angle here. And he's out. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 56 seconds of round number two. To play the winner by not out and still the undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, El Diablo. El Diablo remains. The UFC light heavyweight champion. So, guys, we remain champion. That was fight number 31 for us. Um, a decent fight again against Gustafsson. That was a, a tough, tough fight. We retained the belt, though. Um, I'm going to show you again the outros and stuff that come. What we got? Performance of the night, fight completion, KO win. We got some, got some good stuff. That's decent. That's decent. Um, but yeah, I mean, we're in, we're in good shape now. We're in good shape. We're, we're looking. If, if there are 40 fights, then we got nine fights left. And we are done. Again, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for tuning in. Leave a like on the video. This is going to be the end of the episode. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace. Hey, buddy. This is Travis Brown. Nobody else knows better than I do about the knockout bonuses. Good job. Keep training hard.